Hello guys, welcome to my channel, Fora Tricks. Uh, I have already posted two videos. Uh, first one was to how to install Oracle Application Express, and we have done uh, that is in great detail. And the second video was on how to create a workspace uh, where you know where you can work on developing application in Oracle Application Express. So today I'm going to show you how to create a simple application uh, which has uh, insert, update, and delete facilities. Okay, so let's just log in uh, into the workspace. For further detail on how to install, you can watch first videos of this uh, channel for our tricks. Log into localhost 8282 apex f question mark is equal to 4550. Here, Oratrix is a workspace name, admin is the username, and let me give the password. This is the password which you have uh, given at the time of creating an uh, workspace. Just click on sign in. So, this is the place where you can build your applications with the number of options was already given like app builder here you can create your applications you can, uh, I have uh, developed some applications here you can see them second option is uh, you can import some applications also okay which you have already created uh, or exported or something like that this is the area where you know have uh, uh, you can create a database uh, tables and uh, all things so let me show you this is the area where the, all the tables are there. Here you can choose the options like view, and access, sequence, and packages, and procedures, and functional tables. We'll talk on this later. Here you can create your tables. Just click on that and just provide the table name, you know, column names, uh, types, and next, 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 and other things. It's pretty good, easy. But today, I'm going to show you uh, how to create a simple application. So, we'll be creating in an application on this particular table that is EMP. It can take some of the column names like EMP, uh, email, job, anything. Let's just take a look on the data uh, that the table is containing. Uh, these are the demo data, okay, the number of data for them. So, we're going to create an application. In Apex, uh, which gives you an you know report and uh, an insert form. So just click on this create. You need to create a desktop application. You can have mobile, web, seats, and packaged app. This is what is important. Uh, Oracle application have contain uh, different uh, packaged application which you can use to learn Apex. Just click on this meanwhile okay uh, here it's a schema name as uh, I told you that uh, a single workspace can have more than one schema uh, but here we have only one so for a text schema is fine and let me give you this uh, application name the demonstration uh, universal theme cannot be to change anything in it uh, click on next here we need to add some pages so click on add page so this will give you this option there's a number of options blank report reporting form so we are going to select reports and forms as we need a one report and a one form to make an entry we need to have on top of the table top of the parent form so now table name is amp so let me select the MP. We need to have an interactive report and just click on this add page. So you can see this. This will add two pages into our application and one page is for login. Home page that is already created. Two pages, just click on next. Uh, we are not going to have uh, any component from our application, we just click on next. Yeah. A very important thing authentication scheme. Oracle Application Express provides an inbuilt authentication. If you choose this application express accounts, 
then whenever you are logging into your application, so that requires the username and password of your schema, okay, which you have given. Uh, second one is database account. You need to set up your own and no authentication. If you choose this, then whenever you log in into your application, it will not ask you for any username and password. Hope you are getting it. Okay. So for meanwhile, uh, we are going to select this no authentication. Okay. Language and everything looks, looks fine. Just click on next. Here's the just what we have selected. And just click on create application. So this will create the first application of on uh, Oracle application express as the 5.1.0. And it will take some more time. Meanwhile, uh, after completion of this your video, I'm going to post some new, new videos on this series also uh, that will demonstrate further application development with Oracle Application Express. Here is done. We are done with this uh, application. So application created successfully. So as I told you, it will create a three uh, pages. So let's just run application. As we have select no authentication, it will, uh, won't ask you for the authentications. Okay. So here you can see the nice and smooth environment has been created. Now click on this EMP. So this will show you a report. Okay, as you can see, the full report is there. From here you can edit some reports. Okay, change some values. Save or that will automatically save the data. Okay, uh, you can also delete some data if you don't want. So that option is uh, given. Update, delete, and just from here you can have a Create. Hope you like this video and uh, further uh, just subscribe to my channel. Some new videos I'm going to post soon uh, on Oracle application.